Okay, so a few days ago, I uploaded a video talking about the secret character that was found in Piggy Inner City after months, and it would appear that this character is actually Zizzy in disguise. Now, this character here can only be found in Piggy Inner City by the refinery at nighttime, where they teleport in, they wander around a little bit, and then they teleport right back out. Now, Minitune has previously said that any Easter eggs and secrets that we find in Inner City now will give us a huge hint towards the future of the Piggy storyline. And while a lot of people think this is actually Zizzy in disguise, so in this video, we're actually going to be taking an in depth look at this and we're going to be figuring out for sure 100 is this zizzy in disguise so don't tell mini tune but i've actually managed to get my hands on the actual model of the character in the game files now before we hop in and take an in-depth look at this character and what may potentially be zizzy in disguise we need to hop in and take an in-depth look at the sponsor guys i literally could not be more excited to show you today's sponsor which is display now you may have already heard of them but if not they're essentially a company that makes posters but not just any posters metal posters and well this plate was nice enough to send me a bunch of different posters we've got doctor who one of my favorite tv shows we've got the legend of zelda one of my favorite games interstellar one of my favorite movies i love this one halo fans where you at we also got some zelda down there all of this looks incredible and the nice thing about this plate is putting these on your wall is super simple it comes with a magnet right here and then inside of this little book here you're gonna find this little protective leaf you're gonna put the magnet on the leaf you're gonna put the leaf on the wall just like this right here then you're gonna put your display on the wall just like that and then before you know it you've got an entire wall of displays. i even got one right down there and up there and also right there i'll have a link down below in the description you can use to check out display it'll actually also give you an automatic discount whenever you go to purchase one and as well every time you buy a display they also plant a tree as well so you're helping save the planet and getting some cool metal posters and if you're looking for some recommendations obviously i'm a big nerd so here's some brands i love so go check them out link down below okay so first off let me get everyone caught up you can do this yourself here at home or on your pc your tablet your mobile phone whatever but basically you just need to load up inner city and you need to well actually i should say this works best in a vip server because when you join a vip server it becomes dark almost immediately but it does work in any server including a public server but anyway in this video i'm using a vip server basically i just joined in i ran out of the little starting base here you take a left and you go straight back here to the refinery the refinery is in the bottom left of the map and you just want to run this way as fast as possible now if you can get a car around the map there are some cars that spawn in and you have some gas you can definitely use that to get here quicker but those are just no cars that spawn nearby so i thought i would just run this way now you want to run along the left side here kind of like i'm doing because if you don't you're gonna attract a lot of the infected and then you're gonna have to fight them off and then you may miss this character so just be careful not to attract any of the infected now once you reach the refinery back here the character is gonna spawn in a few random places this character seems to spawn down in the valley behind the refinery they seem to spawn on top of the refinery and they also seem to spawn on the side of the refinery now for some reason they don't seem to spawn every night or maybe they just spawned in the refinery somewhere and i haven't exactly found them but if you wait here a night or two you should definitely see them spawn outside and then they'll just kind of wander around the area now i've went ahead and taken some screenshots of this character here and honestly from inside inner city there's not really too much that we can really see about the character we can see they're wearing a dress but you can also tell that Minitune has intentionally made the entire character shadow. They are, they are entirely black, so we can't see who they are. But what Minitune wasn't expecting is for people to actually get their hands on the character inside of Studio. And that's exactly what I've got here. Shout out to Epic Tank. I don't know how in the world he did this. He must be some sort of hacker man or something. But these two models right here are the exact models. The exact models, not recreated, not remade, but the exact model from the one in Piggy Inner City. The first thing I I should note here is that this model is actually named it's called the lonesome wayfarer is the name of the model lonesome meaning well they're lonely they're by themselves and wayfarer meaning that well actually what does wayfarer mean wayfarer is a traveler especially on foot okay so they're a lonely traveler okay now as you can see mini tune didn't exactly model a face on them however there's a bunch we can actually tell just from this model about the character for example if we take a look at their hands we can actually tell what gender they are so if you don't already know this i mentioned it a 
bunch in a you know a previous videos but you can actually tell if they're male or female based on the hands so you can see that this model here both of these they have I, I call them Lego hands you can't really see individual fingers or anything like that they're just giant Lego hands but if I were to bring in someone like pony here and we look at his hands you can see you can actually see individual fingers and that's the difference male characters have individual fingers and female characters do not so this character here whoever they are is definitely female now another interesting thing about this character and another reason why a lot of people are thinking it's Zizzy is if we take a look at the run animation for the character in this footage here you can actually see that the run animation for this character is very similar to the run animation that Zizzy used at the beginning of the mall chapter in book one chapter 10. it's not the exact same but it is nearly identical to that animation and of course if we take a look at the model itself well they do look like a zebra they've got the nose they've got the snout they're white i mean it's clearly not a bunny rabbit or anything like that because you would see the ears now the only issue with this theory is if i bring in zizzy you can actually see that they have two completely different body types you can see the body type of this here is like the 2.0 roblox avatar i believe that's what it's called and if we look at the zizzy well it's a little bit different these shoulders are more wide these are more narrow now the dress itself is exactly the same and the boots but everything else is a little bit different including this right here zizzy has a little black stripe on her arm because she's a zebra and these characters this character here doesn't seem to have that now here's the interesting thing if we take a close look at this character it looks like they actually have bandages on their arms meaning that that stripe right here could actually be on this arm it could just be underneath it so okay it could actually be zizzy again keep in mind that they didn't you know mini tune intentionally didn't model the face so of course the stripes and everything aren't going to show up on the face and of course as well this character shows up near the refinery which is exactly where zizzy died and we saw her last time but there is one other slight problem if we look at the snout of the character it is a little bit different from zizzy's zizzy's goes up and this one does not it goes straight out forward this character also seems to be a little bit shorter than zizzy it's a little bit smaller now of course this could just be mini tune messing up with the sizing or whatever but it does seem to be a little bit different now here's the thing and if this is true this is going to be a huge easter egg in piggy inner city a huge reveal as to what is coming in the future of piggy and that is z right here the sister z now of course you've got the two zizzy sisters you've got z and you've got zuzi and correct me if i'm wrong in the comments but i'm pretty sure z is the special one because throughout the whole series z never actually says anything and mini tuna said there is a reason that z doesn't say anything in the series that is a mystery that we will find out about and it's intentional now the thing is we've only really got one more chapter in book two how in the world is he gonna fit this into the end chapter of book two when there's already so much else to talk about like meaning that if we ever do find out about why zizzy doesn't talk or speak we probably will in inner city now here's the thing we know that piggy inner city takes place in the future but we've never actually thought how far in the future now you might be seeing where i'm going with this but check this out what if we take zizzy out of here what if that's not zizzy what if this character right here is in fact z but all grown up. Now we can do the math here a little bit. We know that Z and Zuzi, they have to be probably around the age of five because there's a journal piece inside the safe place that talks about, is it Z or Zuzi? One of the characters, they can't really write or, or speak it that well. They're a kid, right? They, they haven't really learned the alphabet, which means they're probably around the age of five or six or, or at the most seven. I think most people learn how to do all that when they're five. So I'm just gonna say they're five years old. Now keep in mind that these two right here are are basically identical twins so whichever age she is is the exact same age she's going to be they're literally identical twins so that means that if z is five years old or six years old in piggy book two and if this right here the lonesome wayfarer is indeed z on the search for her sister in piggy inner city well that means she's a, a full-grown adult now or at least close to it now here's the bombshell okay if we do the math all right in piggy book two z is five years old in piggy inner city z is 18 years 
years old. That means about 13 years would have passed between Piggy Book 2 and Piggy Inner City, meaning Z here would be an adult. George Piggy here would also be an adult. And of course, Polney and Zizzy, well, they would be probably over the age of 30. This would mean there would be a huge time jump between Piggy Book 2 and Piggy Inner City, which could well be the case. We know there is going to be one. We've just never really thought about how much of one. So the question now is, well, is this actually Z all grown up? at the refinery looking for her sister in Piggy Inner City. Could be, or it could be Zizzy in disguise. Maybe Minitoon just changed the model up a little bit. So, you know, you know, we would be thrown off a little bit. Let me know what you think down below. Is it Z? Is it Zizzy? Is it maybe her sister Zuzi? Is it a brand new character? It's definitely a zebra because of the white arms. But other than that, we don't really know. Maybe Zizzy's parents, maybe a sister. Who knows? Let me know down below in the comment section. Of course, thank you guys so much for watching. Go check out this place using the link down below. Thank you for the sponsor. Keep subscribing. Keep using Star Code Real Creek. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.